Hey there, I'm Mr. Terry. I'm a high school history teacher. Welcome back to another History Teacher X video. All right, you guys seem to have loved my reaction to the first ever video from Squire that I saw. So this one came out recently and it's doing really well. So I want to check it out. It's called If Saving Private Ryan Was a Russian Film. All right, I'm sure if you've come to this video, you've seen Saving Private Ryan, one of the most famous World War II movies ever. And I'm excited to see their take. All right, the original video is going to be linked below. Please support Squire. And let's get started. All right, we're going to war. Got to get ready. Yeah, all right, Soviet train coming in. What is this like? It's gonna be after Stalingrad or something? Saving Private Ryan, her big, you know, start was D-Day and all that, but then having to find mob, the guy. Starboard side mob, move fast and clear those murder poles. What? Murder poles? Murder holes. What, what did I say? Yeah, the captain wants to murder the poles. It's just been a while <laughs> since I've been up the front. What's no excuse, is it? Russians and the Poles plus Germans and Poles, I mean. Yeah. Rachel Weiss. Yeah, uh, grab a hold of your weapon and I'll see you on the beach. So is he is he Squire? Is that what it is? is or is it like a troop? I don't really know the background. I just saw that one video um, we watched was um, about, wasn't it? It was all quite Northern Front or whatever, or, or whatever. And uh, I love him, like whoever he is. Like he's got the greatest expressions. He's he's so expressive without saying anything. Yes, when the war's over and we're free to vacation on the Soviet controlled Baltic coast. By the way, if you don't know, just so if you don't get lost, we'll see here. The the idea of saving Private Ryan is there's this there's this troop, right, in, in World War II, and their task is to find a soldier who's brothers have been killed in the war and there was a policy that if you know you had like like a, like a family had multiple people go off to war like multiple children and like a certain amount of them died that one would get pulled out of the war so it wouldn't just wipe out their whole family and that was the the goal was to find him that's who you know what, what the, the point was so we'll see if that's we're going to find some russian version of private ryan right what movie is he using here Finding Private uh, I'm Ivan. Looking for Comrade Ivan under here. Uh, no, no, he's not under here. Uh, I'll be out in a minute, and then we'll we'll go and find him then. Shall we? Dude, that's basically how the I'm fight was in Russia. <laughs> Brutal. Six hours. Colonel Young Dizarmov, I've got something you should know about, sir. Yes. Oh, I'm blown off. These three men died at Stalingrad this month. Common. I can sure, guarantee I... the Soviet Union had no. <laughs> had no policy like that. If a certain amount of the siblings die, that one just gets to go home, right? You imagine Stalin doing that? He was like, no, more meat shields, please. <laughs> Ivan, Peter Ivan, Daniel Ivan. Only three losses. Good month. No, sir, the three yeah. men are brothers. I've just learned their mother's going to be getting all three bags of compensatory potatoes at the same time. <laughs> and that's not all, sir. There's a fourth brother. He went into the city this morning. So send the mother another bag of veg. You're wasting my time. <laughs> no, sir. He's only missing, not dead. There's still hope. And if we save him, we can give not only his mother hope, but the Soviet people. What? Sorry, he's missing? As in abandoned his post missing? <laughs> yes, but there's hope. Well, no sympathy. If we can find the bastard then, eh? <sighs> but not to send him home, to throw him to the front lines. Yeah. And uh, shoot him. <laughs> what? Yeah. Take a posse of men, find Ivan, and then shoot him right in his cowardly back. <laughs> but what about the mother, Colonel Yantazamov? Yeah, good point. You know the old proverb, eh? Traitors don't get potatoes. <laughs> Traitors, Look, Traitors don't get potatoes. <laughs> anyway, you let me know when he's shot, yeah? So, so far, this is exactly what would be like if I was to write some kind of alternative for that. Exactly what it would be like. It's like there wouldn't be any compassion, you know. It's so easy to do that, you know, to make fun of the Soviet Union. Like, yeah, that they wouldn't have that type of policy. They have great costumes in these shows. Or in, in the two, two episodes I've seen now, too. Yes, Robinoff. Just want to say, sir, love the plan. Sending all six of us to find one guy. That's a real doozy. Love that. Now that... That was a complaint sarcasm, in Saving Private Ryan, too. Which is defeatism. It's like we're all going to okay. risk our lives. I'm a sir. What is it up here? Ah, this is such bullshit. Careful, you. What, are you going to shoot me, Sergeant? I have a comrade up. 
Oh, God. Oh, no. All right, let's keep moving. <laughs> Brutal. <laughs> Usually in every scene of those kind of movies, you know, they get the gun and then they're like, fine. Nope, just sorry, pro-Soviet people, if you're alive and watching this. All right. So it's like tape mustache. Whose turn is it? Mine, I think. Oh, you're such a cheater. Nothing gets past old Kapazilov. No, 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 no. It's my turn to jump first. <laughs> oh, no. Sniper. This is like Enemy at the Gates. You ever see that movie? The sniper movie? That was pretty good. Medic! Kapazilov's down! Oh, uh, here we go. <laughs> Typical sob story. Look, nobody make eye contact with him. It'll just. You really got the, the Papa Shaw, whatever how you pronounce that gun? Like a replica or a real version Shit. of it? <sighs> Uh, that gun had a crazy high uh, fire or high fire rate, but it jammed a lot. Got a letter. Uh, yeah, I'm a medic, not a postman. Shut oh, up, am I missing something with the away. like metal looking teeth and stuff? I feel like he's representing somebody. With um, your permission, comrade commissar. Comrade Sidesev, do you know how to shoot? Uh, no, it's shite sev, comrade commissar. <laughs> Vasily shite sev. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, do you know how to shoot, Comrade Shaitsev? They're shit Russians. Say. They're not. What? British. Um, I, I mean, a little. God, this is quite stuck, isn't it? You gotta lift it first. Come on. You gotta lift it. It's bolt Guys, action, dude. Help! I'm dying out here. Yeah, well, do it quietly. God, selfish. <laughs> Where's the sniper? Guys! So yeah, it is jammed, isn't it? It's definitely jammed. I'm gonna do something good for a change. I'm gonna show you where that sniper is. Oh! Brutal! Uh, did anyone see where that came from? He's still watching us. He hasn't relocated. <gasps> a sniper that doesn't relocate. Yeah. Try blinding him with that mirror. I know, I look blinding in this mirror, don't I? <laughs> Hang on. By the way, public service announcement, this guy, the beard, this type of beard is not a beard. If this is what you think is okay to have as a beard, be like, yeah, I'm a beard guy. But this is the only thing you can do where it's very thin and and spread out and curled and stuff. You don't grow it. It's not a beard, okay? Not every man needs to have a beard. It's a certain type of facial feature. That's why I only go with scruff. Can't go longer than that. No idea. Oh, is that the sniper? Now, flank him by going through that pipework. I shouldn't have to tell you all this, really. Good luck. Oh, blocked. Oh, uh, Gotta rip it out. Uh, oh, uh, guys! And he's stuck. Oh, he's dead. Oh, no. Oh, they see him moving. Uh, I think I finished him off. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Oh, no. God. You got like the Soviet, like, furry hat, whatever those are called. Those are cool. Look, we haven't got any morphine, so just shut up. Guys, I think I'm going to be stuck. Guys! Uh, okay. Uh, guys, <laughs> Here right. you go. Let's leave while he's He's distracted. got armor. Go in. Bruh, charge him. Charge him. Guys. Charge him. He's OP. <laughs> oh, thank God. You're going back for me. So he's just gonna end up this. Uh, Wait, where'd the sniper go? <laughs> okay, there's only four left. Ivan! This is where it got frustrating in the, you know, in Saving Private Ryan. People die, you know, and and if I remember right, uh, when they actually get to him, it's Matt Damon and was kind of like, like, they're doing all this to save me and like people are dying on the way. Like, it's like this policy is, this is crazy. I don't want people dying on my behalf, you know, just to find him. Steph, go see if the locals have seen him. 
Wait till they see me. Ivan! Ivan! Yeah? You're Ivan! <gasps> yes! Great! Oh no! Now, are we sure? That was the right one. Yeah, that's like, the, close enough, wasn't I it? I forgot. That threw me off guard because I forgot that they weren't trying to save him. They were trying to hunt him down for desertion and execute him. Oh my gosh. I mean, he's an Ivan. I mean, I'm a doctor. I can pronounce him dead. So Might as well. Job done. Hey, Case closed. There's a lot, probably a lot of Ivans, but Ivan. go tell Central Command. I'm Ivan, I think. This is going to be Ivan more difficult than I ever imagined. <laughs> yeah. This fuck is harder to find than the Romanovs. Ivan! <laughs> Uh, that was the ruling family of Russia. They got ousted in the Russian Revolution and then hunted down by the Bolsheviks eventually, and they slaughtered the whole family. That's Tsar Nicholas and all that. Hey, Ivan. Yes, Ivan. Don't you know an Ivan in the Ivan Company? I'm a friend called Ivan, Ivan. That's, so that's what I'm it. talking about. If this is your beard, you don't get to have a beard. That's not a beard, okay? That's face pubes. Doesn't he have a brother called Ivan? Uh... Just, Ivan just telling idea. all the, the, we the, could the viewers. Just, you know, <laughs> what? You know, just... Well, we can't shoot all of them. <laughs> all the Ivans. Can we? Come on. Let's just, you know, Ivan the playing field out. I mean, this guy's I was going to save these rounds until later in case they kill up against the tiger tank, but uh, I guess we have no choice. Yeah, great props and uniforms and costumes. And oh my god, they're literally. Oh, oh my gosh, wiping out all the Ivans. Okay, I was wondering what happened to the sniper. I feel like this is this is more based off a true story than actual saving Saving Private Ryan was, <laughs> like more realistic. As far as the story goes, <laughs> still admiring. So, oh, he's done. Oh, wait, what are you doing? All the Ivans. Wait. Calm. Just making sure. God. Oh. Uh, right. That's it. That's the last of them. Literally, all of the Ivans are dead. Not all of them. Uh oh, who left? What do you mean, comrade? Ivan Drago? My name's fucking Ivan. Oh, no. I'm a fucking Ivan. What? My name is Ivan Danilov. My mum's an Ivan. My dad's an Ivan. Oh, We're all no. a family of fucking Ivans. <laughs> I've got to do it, haven't I? No, no, don't do it. Do not do it. Why? I'm... Are you Ivan too? <laughs> no, you're not. What's your fucking name? It's Ivan, isn't it? <laughs> We're all Ivan. I'm... You're fucking Ivan. It's, it's Jerry. It's Jerry. My name's Jerry. It's Jerry. not Jerry! That was a nickname it? for Germans. No, no, okay, all right. It's that was a nickname Desmond. for Germans. It's Desmond. 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 Oh! Oh! You're a fucking Ivan, aren't you? Yes! Yes, I'm an Ivan! I'm an oh, Ivan! No. Ah! I'm taking this very literal. I'm taking it very far. What have you done, Ivan? We're all the same as Ivans. He's like, I'm doing my job. Comrade Stalin told us. I've heard this. And I never got that girl on the train. I did. <laughs> How sad. Hundreds more victims of the elusive Major Koenig, the German sniper ace that I, Vasily Shaitsev, defeated alone, thus cementing my legacy. Wait, what happened, though? As the greatest sniper the world has ever seen. I think he's going down. Oh. Yep, <laughs> I called it. <laughs> All right, another fun, funny, but really dark video from Squire. Holy cow! <laughs> uh, yeah, that went uh, that went very dark there pretty quick. 
So that was if Saving Private Ryan was a Russian film. How do you guys think they did? In some weird way, like I was saying, I'm like, this almost seems like a more believable story than if it was the actual Saving Private Ryan story. So anyway, that was a lot of fun. If there are other Squire videos you think I should check out, um, drop me some suggestions, especially over on the Discord of the ones I should probably check out most. Because again, I'm new to this channel and there's a lot I need to see. So I'm just wondering if I should keep this up and it's a lot of fun. I want to watch what you guys want to see me comment on, but I want to know what I should prioritize. All right. With that, we'll see y'all next time. Bye.